China's national men's basketball team are preparing for their upcoming qualifiers for the FIBA Asia Cup and Tokyo Olympics. The training camp started last month in Beijing with the squad getting ready to play for the first time since hosting the World Cup two years ago. Sports scene's Damian Jones has the details. Coach Du Feng only has a couple of weeks to get China ready for prime time. With the members of his squad coming off a long CBA season and in some cases, preparations for the national games. That means his 27-man roster needed to get right to work as soon as they gathered in Beijing on May 23rd, especially with the man in charge, determined to throw more young players into the mix with up-and-coming talents like Yu Jiahao, Zheng Fanbo, and Wang Chuanzi selected for the camp. Group B of the FIBA Asia Cup qualifiers are scheduled to take place in the Philippines with the PRC's docket showing games against Japan on June 16th and Chinese Taipei on the 17th, followed by second showdowns against those squads on the 19th and 20th, while Malaysia reaffirmed an earlier decision to withdraw due to the pandemic. Du's team will then head to Canada for the Olympic qualifying tournament with contests against the event hosts on June 30th and Greece on July 1st. The winners from that pool will then meet the prevailing side among Uruguay, Turkey, and the Czech Republic for one of the last four spots at the Tokyo Summer Games. This is a very tough period for the Chinese men's basketball team. I've been a national player and coach since 2001, and this is the most difficult time for our squad. I hope every player and coach can get through this together under the leadership of the Chinese Basketball Association and try our best to finish this year's job. China failed to qualify directly for the Olympics while hosting the 2019 FIBA World Cup, and Yi Jinlian vowed to help the team make it in through the last chance tournament. And even though the star center ruptured his Achilles tendon during last summer's CBA finals, the postponement of Tokyo 2020 gave him a chance to recover and try to fulfill that promise. So the veteran big man is now back in practice and determined to once more lead his squad onto the international stage. I want to play for our country if the national team needs me. I will proceed without hesitation if my physical condition is good enough. The fans hope we can achieve good results, so we will do everything we can and train as hard as possible as we try to rebuild our good image in the hearts of the fans. As the heart and soul of China's national squad for the last decade and a half, he does not want to end his career with the side at a low ebb, especially after participating in four straight Olympics, Athens 2004, Beijing 2008, London 2012, and Rio 2016, with his next goal being to make it five for five at the delayed Tokyo 2020 and not walk away with any regrets. Damian Jones, CGTN.